so social media, it just it's it continues to fascinate us in just what becomes popular in social media. Mm-hmm. Of course, the term we just talked about with Nepo babies, that's a popular term on social media, so it gets a lot of buzz. One thing I caught today getting some buzz in, in, in TikTok. I mean, TikTok, as we know, is a plethora of subjects whatsoever. out there. Unbelievable. From pranks to girls just kind of moving around to the same three or four songs and things yes. and all kinds of different stuff out there. Some very creative stuff out there. Some just uh, stick. Some just ridiculous, yeah. So uh, I think this kind of goes along the, 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 you know, the ridiculous side here. Gaining some popularity on TikTok right now is self-dentistry tips. <laughs> so dentist influencers, okay? Um. So these are people showing how to do some type of dentistry self-care, apparently, from like fixing gaps in your teeth and different stuff, how removing braces on your own. So some things that you would really ordinarily never even should remotely consider doing stuff to your own teeth, that people are watching videos and tutorials and all that and attempting to do on the road. Now, some of the things are very uh, low risk that they talk about that are not permanent, like putting like a, with some of the examples they cite in this article, it was on today.com, by the way, uh, putting like a, a, a temporary like jewel in your teeth and making fangs with, you know, temporary stuff, you know, uh, uh, some you know, whatever paste and stuff. But there's some stuff in here that's like you really shouldn't be doing this at all, and it's very risky. And obviously, uh, you know, orthodontists and dentists are warning people, you know, don't be freaking idiots and do some of this stuff here. So just <laughs> fascinating, amazing. So uh, would you – I know the answer. I don't even have to ask you if you would have remotely considered doing this on their own. Just what are your thoughts of just the – uh, uh, the the current trend of self dentistry tips um, in the world of social media, Keith. What do you think about all this? Well, you already know what I'm thinking. <laughs> <laughs> you morons! I, you already know what I'm thinking. But listen, okay, hey. when it comes to things of the body, there's a, there's a reason people go to school for years to do these things, okay? Yeah. So just yeah. let's not be stupid. Not to mention if you screw up, you don't have the the knowledge to recover uh, and to fix it. So just to stop the stupid stuff. But I think the uh, bigger picture is the Internet, and especially TikTok, has become a way of control for people. Because of the popularity that a video can get, I think people especially somebody who is maybe not powerful or not uh, very well known in social circles, see how can they can control people through videos by getting people to do stupid stuff. And I really think it's a form of control. It's really crazy. If you get something dumb, but you can get out there and popular enough, people will try it. Uh, it's just absolutely dumb. I saw a video the other day. These morons have a somebody's kind of hiding with a camera on a subway and another guy sitting there is next to the old lady there's all kind of people around and he's got this big object covered in plastic and then he uncovers it and it's a little toilet he pulls the toilet paper out sets it on the side pulls his pants down and sits on the toilet and everybody just starts running and scrambling you know just for what shock value just stupid stuff but i think the internet is just people are just trying to see man what can we get people to do Mm-hmm. You know, if, if, if it goes viral enough, morons will try it because they think it's the thing to do now. I just think it's utterly absurd, and people need to be careful. Skinner, what do you think? Young kids are getting dumber and dumber and dumber as well. By the day. <laughs> By the My day, brother. gosh, are you kidding me? Dentistry. What do they look up? You know, we had books. What is it? Uh... Uh, computers for dummies or mm. 
you know, something for dummies. That was our that was our books. People never trying to saw dentistry stupid. for dummies. <laughs> but yeah, dentistry for dummies. Go on TikTok. You can figure out how to. My gosh, I can't believe how dumb this this subject is, and that the fact that we're talking about it just blows my mind even more. To be truthful, uh, I should this. Yeah. You know, so obviously, you, you get stuff like this out there, and some of the other stuff that people can get hurt and do some type of permanent disfigurement to their bodies, but you're still yeah. able to put, so should a platform like a TikTok be more regulated? If you're putting something like this out there, if it's caught, should you, you know, sh should they have the right to ban these type of videos that are, you know, frankly, That's, maybe harming people? That is an interesting question, Fish. And I'm torn between that because now you're talking about a freedom of speech issue. Censorship, um, yeah. I, censorship, and i am already got a problem with, with Facebook right now because they're getting ridiculous. I've been violated twice on Facebook, uh, put in Facebook jail for, for just the dumbest uh, benign comments. Um, my singer in, in my band, the Diamond Phillips Band, was recording me playing drums at a rehearsal, warming up, and I didn't know it. And then he posted it. Uh, later, and I didn't. I never knew he was recording. And I just, if 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 we were in each other's space, it would have came out like this. Well, I'm gonna kill you. <laughs> That's what I said. I'm gonna no. I said I'm gonna. I said I'm gonna strangle you. And I and LOL mm -hmm. was behind it. But yeah, I got in trouble because of that. Mm -hmm. and, and it's like, is, is this an algorithm searching for keywords like strangle? Because sure. you should have a human being looking at this and saying, oh, in the context he said it, this is his friend, and he's playing with them. But no. So I already got a problem with this, this type of censorship. But you make a very, very good point because it's getting out of hand. I'm surprised we haven't seen reports of more serious injuries or deaths coming from some of the stupid stuff people are trying because they see it on TikTok. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know if we'll see. We're going to see the regulations or not. I mean, some of it though is common sense, oh, which is not common. It's no, that, that's guess, not, not anymore on it. Not, not anymore. Common. I guess, I guess you're right. I don't know. Uh, okay. I guess we're based to be seen. If stuff like this is yeah. it becomes more regulated over time. I'm not sure. Hey, Fish here from a came from Gen X with Skinner and Keith. For every like and subscribe you may win a free one-year subscription to the AARP.